Hey everyone, I hope you all are safe and doing good. So I guess you know that if you have done some internships from uh, from some good companies and uh, you have mentioned that in your resume, then at the time of placement, they are going to play a crucial role. Okay. So now we know that how important internships are because you gain practical knowledge. You go to that company and you see that work culture and you actually work on real world projects and all so you get that industry experience that is really going to help you at your interview time at your placement time so if you are searching for an internship in a good company and that will pay you like you get stipend as well then this video is for you yes i'm talking about paytm internship so uh, this is software engineering intern internship in android and six month duration is six month and the stipend is 25,000 per month. Yes, you heard it right. The duration is six month in Bangalore and starts within one month. Like next month is, it is going to start. The last date to, date to apply for this internship is 31st of May. But what are the required skills? Say requirement is basically good understanding of Android SDK, Java or Kotlin. So yeah, it is a little bit competitive for you because uh, because uh, openings are not that much. One or two openings are there and applicants are, yeah, there are many more applicants. So you should be good. So from this, you get that currently you you pursuing or recently completed a degree in computer science, uh, engineering or related field. So it's not like that you have to be a BEB tech. You can be BCA or BSc from IT field or MCA or this kind of thing. You can apply for that, but you have to be good in Java or Kotlin. So from this, you have strong problem solving skills and attention to re uh, detail. So now you can imagine that even in internship, these things are required, right? So if you are good in this thing, then only please apply, right? Otherwise, it's okay. There are so many other internships you can also try or you can upskill yourself. Like during this summer, maybe you... If you are a first year student, so you upskill yourself and next year you can apply for this internship. So DSA, Java, these are, Java is uh, really like widely used in industry. And DSA is also like crucial for placements as well as for internship to build your problem solving skill. So if you want to uh, enhance, if you want to learn DSA with Java and searching for a good resource, then I'm here to help you. You can go for my course, DSA with Java. So in this course, you will get complete from Java. We'll first we'll discuss Java. If you don't know anything about Java or anything about coding, it's okay. You can go for this course. You'll get Java course. Then we'll uh, complete DSA from basic to advanced. Okay. And it's not that it, I'll give you some just recorded theory lectures and all. I know practically so much important while you, while you are going for DSA. So we'll be solving placement questions, lead code questions. You'll be given quizzes, assignments and projects as well. Practically, we'll, we are going to apply our knowledge in the form of projects. And yeah, I know you will get stuck definitely when you are going for any course. So we will have a live doubt resolution session every week. So you join that session and I'm here to help you. You can ask your question. I'm here to answer. Right. Other than that, if you are not able to join sometimes live session, it's okay. I will give you access to a dedicated WhatsApp group. You can just ask any question on that WhatsApp group and you can personally message me on WhatsApp. I'll reply on that also. So it's like I'm just one message away from you. Okay, after course completion, you will get a certificate as well. But apart from certific certification and all, skills are really important. That you will definitely get here. So complete Java and then we will cover DSA. As well as you will get my notes, handwritten notes. These are detailed handwritten notes you will get for revision. It's very good. Right? So uh, you can go to the, the website and you can check what we have uh, covered till now. The link you will get in the description box of this video. And right now our coupon is still going on. Gift 15, you will get extra 15% discount. And if you are interested only in Java, in learning Java, it's okay. There is a Java course as well. You can check out and you can go for this Java course. Right? Here also same. We will complete Java from starting to end. And uh, then same live session you will get, dedicated WhatsApp group you will get. We'll be solving placement question, lead code question, projects, quizzes, assignments, and much more. Right? So you can check out. The link you will get in the description box of this video. Uh, check out this. So now let's back to the in internship. This internship. What are the requirements? 
degree in computer science or currently if you are pursuing you can apply for that also right in engineering computer science or any related field good understanding of java or kotlin or android sdk familiarity with android studio and version control system like git knowledge of restful apis json and third party libraries as well and you have that eagerness to learn something new definitely and you have strong problem solving skill preferred skills are if you have experience with firebase room db or jetpack component yeah you will be given higher preference plus if you have if you have any your app published on play store or you have a portfolio on github i always tell student that please maintain your github a portfolio on github start using github whatever you upload whatever you uh, work like you develop projects and all upload that on github it's very important online presence online portfolio nowadays is very important whether it's linkedin and github both linkedin as well as github so see portfolio on github what you will learn obviously hands on experience with real world mobile application development you will be working on real world projects mentorship mentorship you will get from experienced android developers and opportunity to work in live projects and contribute to product development plus one more important point is if you perform very well then you can also get a full time job offer that that is based on your performance okay so uh, yeah key skills are android java kotlin jetpack and vm so don't worry the link you will be given in the description box of this video you can go and check out check out the internship and simply you can apply you are if you have registered already on this nokri dot com then you can directly apply or if you haven't registered then first register to apply and then apply create your nokri profile from here and after that you can apply right it's not that much tough and please don't pay anything it's completely free if there is some step that you are supposed to pay something registration fee or anything skip it you are not supposed to pay anything right so for this also link you will get in the description box of this video if you are facing any other difficulty while applying you can just let me know in comment section okay so that's it for now this video now i'll see you in the next video till then bye bye take care